driving through Illinois, and can you say miles and miles of cornfields? Wow, we're really ready to get out of the van and to see something new. We'll be there soon. Potty break time, and this is how I take the dogs out all at the same time. I just attach their leashes with a small piece of rope, and that way everybody stays together. Simple trick, gets the job done, and now maybe they'll do their business so we can get back on the road. Going through the drive through of our favorite place, McDonald's. Hello, Hi. how are you? I'm good, how are you today? Got a side salad and a burger and a coffee, right? Right. Oh, good. Thank Have you. You too. Yeah, guess who's getting the salad and guess who's getting the burger? I wonder. Here we go, and we're going to park right here, and we're going to have ourselves a little lunch. There's no dine-in when you're driving around with dogs. It's eating in the car, mm, and we're hungry. So we're out of the van, and we're finally at the hotel, and I'm about to go out to the fairgrounds to check out the stage because we start tomorrow. We're here in Iowa in lovely Jackson County about to get set up for our first show of the day. Here's the props that I'll be putting together to make the lovely stage. There is no stage hand, it's just me and the doggies. And there's one of them now, my retired boy Cupid. We gotta get going. So our little area is set up and we're about to start the first show of the day for the Magical Poodle. Did you guys enjoy the show? Yeah. Yeah? Who was your favorite? Oh, you liked Amelia. Who was your favorite? Blondie. Oh, wow. So I'm here with my friend Ron Dini, the great Ron Dini magic show and weird science. Weird science. Oh, yeah. And he has dared me and I've dared him to try something fried at the fair. So I have a Snickers. And I have round, round, yummy looking Oreos from the beautiful ladies at the We need to go to Granny's right. Sugar Snack. Here we go. All right. Here we go. Oh. That is so good. But if I eat all this, I'll never fit into my Poodle Mama costume. And I'll never be able to go back to the future. Right, Scott? It's our day off. And can you see what the favorite pastime of the doggies is? Oh, yeah, they're having a nice little siesta. This is our second show at the Davenport Fair in Iowa. And we have a lovely audience waiting for the magical poodles. Everybody say poodle! Poodle! All right. So I've really fallen in love at this fair with this little baby camel, just five weeks, five weeks old? Did you name her yet? No, I think, I think oh. I'm thinking about Bala. Oh, but can I name her Gigi? Because she looks like a Gigi to me. It's Hi, Gigi. Boy. Oh, it's a boy. He can, oh, Jojo then. <laughs> oh, look how beautiful a little baby camel. Look at that wet stage. We're going to have to get that nice and dry before we go on and perform. So maybe in the meantime, we should go get a corn dog. What do you think, Pirouette? Maybe? Oh, maybe not. All right. We just finished the show with the Davenport fan. The doggies are getting some love from their fans. They're having such a great time. That's the end of the fair here at Davenport. The stage is empty, and the poodle wagon is full, packed, and ready to go. We're on to the next fair. See you there.